Hey guys, welcome to something a little different uh, on my channel as you can see from the title. Um, Dave uh, from the Fragrance Bros was uh, generous enough um, in this latest split that I got with him um, on fragrances. So if you're checking this video out and you don't know who I am, I'm actually a fragrance reviewer on YouTube and uh, basically one of our fragrance reviewers, uh, Dave, um, splits fragrances for me. So. Uh, I got a fragrance right here and I have half the bottle and other people get a little bit of the uh, the juice inside to try it out. Anyway, um, Dave was gracious enough. This is out of his own pocket. So Dave, thank you very much. Hopefully you find this video entertaining. He bought me a bunch of candy, which is awesome. You know, it's December and uh, he, he basically said he was looking into candy that's uh, not available in Canada, something that I could try. So I'm excited. When he told me that, I was excited. I was probably even more excited about the candy than the beautiful juices I had <laughs> that we split. But um, anyway, he's got uh, five candies here, two chocolate bars and some other candy here for me to try. Um, and uh, some of them I recognize the names just because we do have them available in Canada. I don't know the particular flavors. If not, the two chocolate bars, we do not. From what I know, I've never seen these in uh, where I am. So very interested in seeing what those are. So thank you, Dave. Um, hopefully you enjoy this video. Something a little different on my channel. Um, so I'm just going to get the camera onto these products to let you guys know about them a little bit. <laughs> now, guys, these are the five candies that Dave sent to me. Um, he mentioned that those are the ones that he thinks that are not available in Canada. Um, I know these two chocolate bars I've never seen around my way. A bit of honey I've never seen. Um, these two, Chewy Lemonhead and Frosty Nerds. I know we have Nerds and I believe we have Lemonheads here in Canada. Um, maybe not this kind. Um, I don't eat candy that much so I can't really say but I know f for sure that we've had Nerds in, in Canada ever since I was a kid. But these two chocolate bars, I'm the most excited that I'm about to try is probably the Payday. It looks pretty uh, good. It has uh, peanut caramel bars. So um, you always get, you see how he got me the king size on these, like, uh, I'm, I don't know, maybe he's thinking that I'm wilting away, that he, uh, <laughs> he wants to get me, uh, the biggest size available, but this one looks probably the best, just out of the description, it says, uh, peanut caramel bar, so that looks very interesting. Um, Frosty Nerds, probably number two here, uh, it has a watermelon flavor, I really like, uh, watermelon as a flavor, um. Lemonheads is probably next. Um, it's got assorted fruit. So this one has what? Lemon, grape, orange, cherry, and it looks like green apple. Um, so we'll see what those flavors are. And whatchamacallit would probably be next as far as what I think would be the best. It has chocolate, peanut flavored crisp, and caramel. Um, I'm not a huge fan of peanut butter and chocolate to be honest. So it says peanut flavored chips or crisps. So I'm not too sure what that means, but we'll see. And then lastly, I think these are going to be the, the worst of the bunch. I know this is a hard candy, a bit of honey, um, with real honey and almond bits blended into taffy. Um, so we'll see. Those are probably the worst for to, to get cavities. But we'll see. It's going to be uh, interesting. I'm going to try them out and tell you guys what I think about them. This is probably the one I'm most excited about. Or hopefully I don't like it too much because it will be hard to find here in Canada. So let's get into trying them. <laughs> So now that you guys know what Dave got me, I'm going to go from what I think from the packaging and description from best to worst, from from what I feel is going to be best to worst. I'm going to try the Bitter Honey. I think this is the one that I'm not going to like. Um, personally, I'm not a huge hard candy person, especially like taffy and stuff like that. So let's, let's try out the Bitter Honey. Um, I'm going to bring these. To the office so I just want to thank you Dave from everybody in my office they're gonna try these out uh, when I bring them to tomorrow here um, so it's again wrapped up it's kind of like a toffee candy here if you have never seen bit of honey candy um, yeah so it's a hard candy as I kind of thought <laughs> this is gonna be hard on my teeth yeah this is gonna be a long chew I think mmm yeah so, bit of honey. Yeah, this is gonna be a long chew. 
what I came to expect. It's a hard candy, it's very sweet. It has that toffee like feeling, a little bit of honey. Um, there's almond bits in here. I'm not a huge fan of these, to be honest. I don't like candy like this, like the, that's just sitting in my mouth. <laughs> Now I'm back. Um, since I'm a fragrance reviewer and I rate everything from, you know, a scale to something, I'm going I'm to rate these. Bit of honey from uh, a scale to one to five. I'd probably give this like a one or a two. Um, not really my kind of candy. Um, I'm sure the people in the office, some people are going to love that kind of candy. So next is, I think it was the chocolate bar that I felt like was going to be the second worst. It's the whatchamacallit, whatchamacallit chocolate bar. Uh, made with chocolate peanut flavored crisps and caramel. Um, looks interesting. I don't think this is going to be. I love the name, which I'm going to call it. Is, that's awesome. So let's open her up and let's see this bar. Split it open. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh. It kind of looks like Rice Krispies in there with some caramel and chocolate. Okay, okay, okay. I can dig that. So let me see. Mmm, peanut butter, see? I'm, I'm one of those guys that don't like Reese peanut, peanut butter cups. No. Not bad though. My wife's gonna love this. Dave, I'm gonna give this to my wife, she's gonna love it. But, uh, not bad though. I'm making a mess now, in my fragrance room. Um, three out of five. I give it a three out of five. I was actually a little surprised for pe people that like peanut butter. This is probably a higher rating for them. I'll finish it off. Not bad. All right. All right. Next is the lemon heads. These are chewy lemon heads. Uh, fruit mix. Again, I kind of showed you in the video which uh, which kinds there is. So there's five of them. So please be patient with me since I'm going to try all five flavors, why not? Um, probably the best one. Usually in these kind of flavors, I probably, I'm probably going to like the grape more than anything. So we'll start with the orange. Oh, they're chewy. They're pretty good. Orange. Has kind of like that lemon head kind of sourness. Green apple. Mmm, green apple, much better. Lemon. Sorter. Um, these kind of candies, lemon is usually the worst. You know how you get suckers? I never go for the yellow one. <laughs> cherry. Mmm, cherry beats out apple. And grape, my favorite, probably. Yeah, great. My favorite. Really good. Four out of five. I'm not sharing with the wife with this one. Those are staying with me. Um, very, very good. Four out of five. Love the grape. Green apple. Cherry. Really good. Orange and lemon. I could pass. Not a big citrus guy. All right. Next. The one that I thought it was going to be number two. Nerds. I always loved nerds when I was a, a kid. This is uh, obviously the... Um, it's... Uh, they're selling this for Christmas, I think. It's a limited edition um, with the green, red, and white nerds. Um, again, we have nerds in Canada. I'm pretty sure if I looked around, they probably have these, I'm assuming. Um, yeah. I don't know if trying out one nerd at a time is going to help. I got a watermelon one here. Cherry. Mm. Maybe do a bunch. Yeah. Nerds are nerds. Mm. Nerds are better when you get like 20 of them in your mouth. No homo. <laughs> Not bad. Three out of five. I actually prefer the lemon heads. Than this, which is surprising because I like watermelon flavor, but nerds, nerds really don't give you that 
huge burst of flavor until you have like a whole bunch of mouthful in there and then it gives you that full nerds flavor so the one I'm looking out for the one that excites me the most is the payday bar um never well not that I never heard of this but I knew about it um, but we don't have it in, in around my my area you'd probably have to go to a specialty store to get this um, I'm excited because it has got peanut caramel and uh, chocolate so it should be good see I don't like a peanut butter taste but if you got full peanuts in a, in a chocolate bar that'll work that'll work for me so let's take a look payday bar oh it uh, does not look <laughs> I did not know that it was going to be full of peanuts. <laughs> that is nuts. I thought they were going to be inside. I thought it was going to be chocolate covered. Um, so that's a little interesting. No chocolate. Okay, I thought there was chocolate in this. Apparently not. Oh, I didn't say it here. It said peanut caramel bar. I should have known better. Oh, this might be too pe pe peanutty, right? Oh, salty. Huh. Oh, nuts are salty. <laughs> Hmm. Not bad. Yeah. It's missing the chocolate. You know? If you had chocolate covering this. So. Too many nuts, man. Too many. Not bad, though. I'll give that to the wife. So. So in closing, first of all, this was tons of fun. Thank you, Dave, um, for just giving me this. And I, when I saw this, I had to do a video on it. I know it's a little, something a little different on the channel, but it's nice to throw something different on the channel and see what you guys think about it. Um, my rating scale was pretty close, like from what I thought was going to be the best to the worst. Um, obviously, a bit of honey. I called it. I don't like this kind of candy, to be honest, these hard candies. One out of five, two out of five, whatever. Um, no. Whatchamacallit kind of surprised me a little too much. Too much of that peanut buttery type taste, but uh, not the worst chocolate bar in the world, but not something I would purchase. Dream Lemon Heads were probably the most surprising. I really absolutely love the grape, cherry, and apple. I'm not sharing with the wife for this one. <laughs> it's probably the best candy out of the whole bunch, to be honest. The one that I like the most. Nerds, standard. Um, you know, very solid. I love it. And payday, which I thought <laughs> surprised the hell out of me right when I opened the. I didn't know there was going to be that much. I thought there was going to be chocolate covered with the peanut uh, caramel. No, it was straight up peanuts and caramel. Um, good, but a little too much uh, nuttiness for me. Um, so again, thank you, Dave. Um, really a great, uh, great thing to do. I really, really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, comment below if you've uh, tasted any of these. Um, very interesting combo there. Again, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.